just uh, on behalf of Saiprama Foundation, uh, I, you know, this is a very small uh, act of love and gratitude uh, to our frontline heroes. They they are um, they will dedicate themselves and sacrificing, uh, you know, their time uh, as well as uh, risking themselves. Uh, you know, they've got families at home, so this is a very small token of uh, love and gratitude. Uh, you know, to them to say thank you and to tell them that we, we, we care for them. So this is for all the frontline heroes. So thanks very much for the opportunity. And I I want to say this this can only be possible um, uh, because of the help uh, you know which is given to us by the New Zealand High Commission and the High Commissioner. So we're very, very grateful to you uh, for your support for our foundation and to Virginia as well. Um, so th thanks for your support and having confidence uh, in our foundation to do this. And like I said, we can only do it if it's done together. So, uh, just a very small, uh, you know, expression of our love and gratitude. I think uh, this is what's needed in the world today: uh, that uh, compassion and the gratitude, and um, and to say thanks to um, you know to those who are who are on the front line, um, risking it all. While I think a lot of us are, you know, sitting at home, and well, I hope everyone's sitting at home. Um, you know, and being comfortable, but they they are doing so much more. So just a big big work a level for them. Uh, Honourable Minister um, uh, Sumit, uh, it's a pleasure to be a part of this event today and to partner with the Cyprema Foundation and the Ministry of Health and Medical Services um, to provide these um, these gifts of gratitude to frontline healthcare workers. Um, we've seen how critical they are in the fight against COVID-19. They're out there every day uh, helping the community to be safe and to track down and eliminate uh, the COVID-19 virus, which is still out there in Fiji at the moment. And while they're doing that, uh, they don't have the opportunity perhaps to look after themselves as, as well as they might like or to look after their own families. And our partnership with the Cyprema Foundation and the Ministry of Health is an important part of recognising that and doing what we can to help the people who are out there working for us and helping all of Fiji to beat this, uh, this virus. So I'm very grateful um, to be able to work not only with the Government of Fiji but also with our civil society partners such as Cyprema Foundation um, to reach those in need as best we can. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Kapoon, again. I uh, want to say uh, thank you very much and appreciate uh, the gratitude packs that are here, uh, together, uh, working together, Cyprema Foundation, also uh, New Zealand High Commission and the New Zealand government. We are very grateful, as rightfully said, it's gratitude packs. Uh, and the four frontline staff, we uh, offer them a place to stay, uh, stay and three square meals a day. But again, you know, these are other things that are important because they do not have time to go to the shop, you know, maybe get a biscuit or maybe, you know, get something else that they would like. Some banner, for example, in the gratitude pack serves that purpose. And so we are grateful for that and also for the other organizations that have come forward uh, in uh, helping or with uh, supporting the front As I've said, they don't have time to go to the shop don't have time to go to go and get something for themselves different from the three square meals that we offer. And uh, at this time we are very grateful also to the front landers uh, all over Fiji. You must have seen the pictures those who are coming from Mombasa over to Bitilew. Uh, as you know in Tisiasa, Paralak went from Bitilew over to Udolew. And so there's a, there's a, there's a lot of uh, uh, unity within the system and also a lot of love that exists between the frontline uh, healthcare workers and also the other ministries that we work with, including the, the, the marvelous work that the discipline forces are doing in helping us to maintain the spaces that we have. And I just want to reiterate the messages that uh, we've been setting out, that Dr. Fong has been saying, that it's so important that uh, we adhere with the uh, public health COVID safe measures. Uh, organizations, companies must do that, must ensure that they have means to be able to check Kefiji app, places to sanitize hand, masking when people enter into their premises, but also uh, all of us in Fiji to show leadership and responsibility. If we don't have to get out during this weekend, please stay home. 
to stay home and, and uh, please maintain our bubbles. I think that's important. Maintain our bubbles and try as much as possible not to allow somebody from a different bubble to penetrate into that bubble. I think that's another important message that we have to understand. So once again, thank you, Sai Prama. We've been working together for so many times. Thank you again, uh, Your Excellency. Thank you again for the 500,000 doses that um, are coming through to Fiji. It will be obviously a big help. And I know that the front riders will, will enjoy this and something just to lift the spirits when they come back from a hard day or hard time traveling.